the Jeep Compass has been a runaway success in India, but we are here in slightly sunny Australia. It's quite cold actually, and not exactly like the marketing they would have you believe about the heat and the beach bodies and uh, you know all the beach life. And what we are here driving is the Compass Trailhawk, a version that's not available in India yet. And Jeep India officials won't tell us whether it'll come or not. But I think uh, what we're going to do today is take it for some serious off-roading. And I think we're going to have a lot of fun. Uh, this is powered by the 2-litre diesel, mated to a 9-speed automatic, which is not available in India yet. But uh, it's a day I'm looking forward to. And let's see how the car fares. What we're doing here in rural Tasmania, right outside Hobart, is driving the Trailhawk, like I said earlier. Uh, and you know, it's a slightly difficult trail. It's probably not as difficult as I thought it would be, but what helps here is the four-wheel drive that is available on the Jeep, on the Compass, along with the 170 horsepower of the 2-liter diesel, and especially the 350 nm of torque. That really helps, and with these big rocks, you know, it's, it's easy to sort of navigate around them. It's easy to na navigate on, I mean, these are no roads, these are non-existent roads, but it, it shows you the Trailhawk with its additional capability uh, offers a lot more. I mean, you can always ask if a regular commuter or a person who sticks to urban driving needs the Trailhawk, probably not. But if you're somebody who likes going off-road, who likes tackling the rough stuff, who likes sort of the outdoor life. I think uh, the Compass Trailhawk, given its compact size, uh, a pretty decent amount of power, excellent quality, makes a lot of sense. In Trailhawk trim, the Jeep Compass offers another segment first, an SUV with true off-road capability. Of course, other than the selectable off-road modes like sand, rock and snow with the Jeep Select Terrain, you also get the ability to manually select the four-wheel drive mode and lock the transfer case in four-wheel drive low. However, that does not mean that the on-road driving appeal of the Compass Trailhawk changes in any way. It still remains a capable on-road SUV with excellent ride comfort and handling. Add to this the ease of using the 9-speed automatic with the diesel engine and it only makes the Trailhawk that much more attractive both on and off the road. Jeep India has confirmed that the Compass Trailhawk will reach the Indian market later this year, but not yet indicated the pricing for it, which is expected to be quite premium and above the existing manual diesel version. For someone who likes their SUV with proper off-road capability, the Compass Trailhawk makes for an excellent and the only choice in this segment.